Hello, what's up guys mga kapamilya, mga kapatid, mga kapuso Welcome back again to my channel Oreology At ngayon, talakayin natin ang limit of trigonometric function Ang ingay ng aso Ayan, so Ang technique dito sa limit of trigonometric function Ay huwag kakalimutan yung konsepto ng simplifying trigonometric expression kasi posible ang maging denominator dito o maging undefined yung expression natin so kapag nagiging undefined yung expression natin pag sinasubstitute natin yung value ng variable ay nagiging undefined so hindi pwedeng maging undefined so kailangan natin isimplify yung function okay so bago para hindi maging undefined Okay, so example number one. So limit of sine two x over cosine x, where x approaches two by over two. Okay, so example nyan. So substitute natin si pi over two. So we have sine two times pi over two over cosine pi over 2. Ako, ako kasi hindi sanay sa region. So, ang ginagawa ko ay degrees. So, sine 2 times ito ay sorry, cancel na pala to. Magiging pi na lang which is equivalent to 180 degrees over cosine pi over 2 is 90 degrees. So, cos ay sin 180 is 0. Okay? So, cos 90, pag cos 90 ay 0 din. Okay? Gamit yung kamay. So, yung hindi pa nakakapanood ng technique, kahit walang calculator, paano isolve. So, watch my video. Okay? About the trigonometric values. So, continue tayo. Cos 90 is also 0. So, bawal yung ganitong case. So, anong gagawin natin? So, i-simplify natin yung trigonometric function. So, si sin si sin 2x so, gamitan natin ng identities that is double angle. Ang identity ng double angle ay 2 sin x cos x over cos x where x approaches 2 by over 2. So, ito, cancel na siya. So, ang mangyayari dito ay the limit of 2 sin x where x approaches 2 by over 2. So, ayan, pwede na tayong mag-substitute ulit. So, the limit of 2 sin pi over 2 where hindi, substitute na pala. Substitute doon, magiging, ito ay 2 sin 90. Sin 90 is 0. Okay? Sin 90 yung kamay. So, ito ay magiging 0. So, 2 times 0, the answer is 0. O, oh, ganun lang yung value nyan. Okay, next, number 2 tayo. Number 2 The limit of tangent theta minus cosecant theta So the limit of tangent theta minus cosecant theta Where x approaches 2 pi over 4 okay, So madali lang man yan ay theta pala So, si theta magiging pi over 4. So, magkaroon ka ng tangent pi over 4 minus cosecant pi over 4. So, which is, ito ay 45 degrees. So, ito tangent that is the same as sine 45 degrees over cosine 45 degrees minus 1 over, ang, secant, ay, ang cosecant ay 1 over sine. So, 1 over sine 45 degrees. So, si pi over 4, ginawa ko ng 45 degrees. So, this is 
sin 45, 45, so ito ay square root of 2 over 2. Over, ang cosine naman ay kaliwa, square root of 2 over 2. Minus 1 over, ito naman ay sin 45, square root of 2 over 2. So, this is equivalent to 1. Parehas yung numerator and denominator. 1 minus, take the reciprocal, nagiging 2 over square root of 2. So, LCD nila, square root of 2, square root of 2, minus 2. So, meron tayong... Ayan, 2 minus 2 square root of 2. Okay, so simplify natin. Rationalize the denominator. So, multiply po the numerator and denominator by square root of 2. So, so we have 2 times, square root of 2 times square root of 2 is 2. Kasi 2 times 2 ay 4. Square root of 4 is 2. Minus 2 square root of 2. Over 2 times 2. 4 square root of 4 is 2. Okay, so factor 2. 1 minus square root of 2 over 2. So cancel na si 2. So ang sagot ay 1 minus square root of 2. Okay, next. Number 3. Sandali lang din to. Limit of sine squared x over 1 minus cos x where x approaches to 0. So, limit ng sine squared x over 1 minus cos x where x approaches to 0. So, kung isisimplify na natin to where x magiging 0 sine squared x 0 over 1 minus cos 0. Sin squared, uh, sin 0. So, ito ay parehas lang siya ng sin 0 quantity squared. Ang sin 0 kasi ay 0 over what is 1 minus cos 0. Cos 0 is square root of 4 over 2 or 2 over 2 which is 1. Cos sin 0 is 1. So, 0 over 0. Hindi rin pwede. So, ang gagawin dyan ay simplify ulit yung trigonometric expression. So, si limit ang value ng sine squared x. So, gamitin yung Pythagorean identity. So, that is the same as 1 minus cosine squared x over 1 minus cos x where x approaches to 0. Next, factor ito, difference of 2 squared. Parang x squared minus y squared. Ang factor niya ay x minus y, x plus y. So, ganun din dito. Perfect squared to perfect squared din yung cosine squared x. So, ang mangyayari, 1 minus cos x times 1 plus cos x over 1 minus cos x where x approaches to 0. So, tayo na tayong makancel to. So, matitira, limit of 1 plus cosine x where x approaches to 0. Next, substitute now x to 0. 0 to x, sorry. So, we have 1 plus cosine 0. And then, itong cosine 0 cosine 0, so square root of 4 over 2 or 1 value. So, 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. Okay, that is number 3. Next number, so limit of sine x squared pi over 2, which x approaches to 2. 0. So, sin 0 minus pi over 2 which is sin negative pi over 
or that is the same as sine negative 90 degrees. So, 90 degrees sine 90, that is 0. 0 ba or negative 1? Sine. Sine 90, ito ang itutupin natin. So, that is negative 1. Sine x. Where x approaches to 0. Okay, so, simplify natin to magiging 1 minus cos 0 over sin 0. 1 minus cos 0. Cos 0 is 1 over sin 0 naman ay 0. Okay, so 0 over 0, hindi wede. So, ang kailangan natin is simplify ito. So, si limit ng 1 minus cos x over sin x. x approaches to 0. So, ito ay mangyayari dyan ay limit ng 1 minus cos x over sin x. Magmumultiply tayo ng 1. Na yung 1 na to, ang equivalent niyan ay 1 minus cos x over sin x. Ang equivalent niyan ay, yung conjugate na ito, 1 plus cos x over 1 plus cos x. So, equivalent 1 lang to. Okay, so multiply the numerator by the numerator. This will become 1 minus cos squared x over sine times 1 plus cos x. So we have limit of x approaches to 0. So ito, Pythagorean identities, that is sine squared x. Okay, so sine sin x 1 plus cosine x so cancel na to may matitira pang isang sin dito so so we have sin x over 1 plus cos x where x approaches to 0 next substitute na na yung 0 Sa x. So we have sine 0 over 1 plus cosine 0. What is sine 0? 0. Cosine 0, 1. So 0 over 2. Final answer is 0. 0 divided by 2 is 0. Okay, so that's all for today. So wag kakalimutan po mag-subscribe. So sana natuto kayo sa lesson na to. That's all and God bless.